Okay, so just quickly for those who still have questions regarding this circuit here. So the first question here uh, is to check whether the diodes are forward biased. So we understand that in order for a diode to be forward biased, the anode here need to be more positive in terms of the supply voltage. So if you check here, we've got two supply voltage. Now, if you run your loops here, you will see that the plus 5 volt here and the plus 8 volt, they're going to subtract. Okay, so you will end up having the voltage, the forward voltage being negative. That will be minus 3 volt if you run the loop. So that means that this diode will not be forward biased. Okay, so on this one here, it's very simple so the 100 volt will flow this way so look at it this way because this is ground and the ground level is always at zero but between zero level and the minus 100 volt here at the cathode zero is more higher than the minus 100 so which means the anode here will be more positive than the cathode because zero is bigger than minus 100 volt however you see it so in this case this diode will be forward biased now you come to this point here at this point here you have a 30 volt that will flow in this direction so what you will have at this point here this is a critical point in order to determine whether this diode is forward biased so the voltage at this point will basically be the based on the voltage divider from these two resistors combined and the 4.7k here. So if you take your 30 volt, you add these two resistors, you run your equation, you're going to have a voltage here at this point. Because remember, you only need a 0.7 volt to forward bias diode. So this particular one, the diode is forward biased. Now you come to this one here okay so what do we have here you've got a plus 10 volt and you have a minus 20 volt okay so if you run the loop this way so if your loop goes like this the diode will be forward bias but if your loop goes this way what will happen is these two voltage here they're going to be in series okay so they're going to add up because they are moving on the same direction 